Hey guys, I'm Margie Blash and welcome to Hollywood.com. Well, the AFI Film Festival is in full effect and tonight we're at the special screening of Southland Tales. What was it about this role that really made you want to be a part of it? Was it the role or was it the director, the cast? It was the director. I was very shocked because the script came to me late. I read it and I thought, oh my God, you know. All right, I'll just go for it. it. It wasn't that fun for me to play someone like her, but I just decided to get into it and go for it. I got very sick because I smoked all kinds of stuff. I was supposed to be smoking crack and drinking, and we were always around smoke and pornography, and it was just had that feel to it. Have you seen it yet? I have, and I'm describing it. I don't know if you've heard me speaking, but uh, it's very experiential. It's very, I'm sure, quite controversial. It's very immature, violent, terrifying, profound, serious, not so serious. It reminds me of Picasso's Guernica, uh, which that painting, which is one of my favorite paintings at the time when it came out, was very controversial, but depicted war and the whole Nazi regime and what they did to that little town in Spain. And this film depicts what all of us are kind of doing to our society and having willful ignorance and not wanting to look. Richard Kelly makes you look. And it's the world of pornography, celebrity, politics, energy crisis, all coming together in one chaotic film. I wish I'd said that all the way down the line. My words came to me for you. But that's, that's the way I perceive this film. I think it's gonna shake people up and make awake people up. What I'm trying to get across is uh, I want to, to challenge audiences to think about you know what's going on in the world and uh, alternative fuel, homeland security, uh, protection of our civil liberties, and uh, pop culture and its sort of influence on the world. And I just want to get people talking and, and thinking about where we're headed and uh, where we're going on the next election year. Really. What was it like working with uh, Richard as the director? I'm really grateful because he gave me. Um, all the freedom to contribute whatever I have as actress to my character really trusted me. So I wearing a wig actually, so shares wig, like this big. They're trying to push it down but still hair on top because it's very long. And my outlook of the character I really like is like me and him, Richard and the costume designer I created together. And it really shows my, my body in a way and fits that character in a very sensual and free way. Beautiful, beautiful woman.